Software Spring Presence Part 1, How to use Max and Mix Part 2, How to use Offset, Match, and Max, together in Google Sheets Hello and welcome to this two-part tutorial Part 1, How to use Max and Mix Here's an introduction to the max and min functions. The max function returns the maximum value in a data range. The min function returns the minimum value in a data range. OK, here are the formats of the max and min functions. Here, value 1 can be a single value or data range, and value 2 is optional. Alright, let's look at an example of the max and min functions. I will type the max function in this cell. Type equal to, and M. Select max from the menu. For value 1, I will specify this column. Press enter. There you go. 2143, is the maximum value in this range. Now, I will type the min function in this cell. As before, type equal to an M. Select min from the menu. For value 1, I will again specify this column. Press enter. OK, 2012, is the minimum value in this column. Part 2, how to use offset, match, and max together. When you get the maximum or minimum value from a range, you may also want to get the corresponding item name. In this example, the corresponding item for max value is, purchases. Here's a conceptual illustration of a method, to get both the max value, and the corresponding data. Nest the max function inside match. Then, nest the match function inside offset. How does this work? First, we will take a look at the format of the match function. Match returns the position of the search key in the range. In this example, search key is the maximum value. The range is this. Search type is 0, because we want an exact match. I will type the match formula, to get the position of the maximum value, 2143. We don't want it to hard code the max value. So, let's nest the max function, for the search key, inside the match function. The range of max and match are the same. Let's substitute the actual values for a match. Alright, now we will look at the format of the offset function. For cell reference, type A3. For offset rows, use the match max combo. For offset columns, let's type 0, because we do not want to offset any columns, as we want to extract this data. For height, type 1, because the data we want is in one row. For width, type 2, because the data we want, spans two columns. Alright. Here is the final formula. Moving forward, let me type the offset formula in this cell. There you go. The offset match max combo has returned both the maximum value and the corresponding data. That's it folks. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to this channel 